This is my newest project I'd like to share with uh, all of you. It is a, a wave player based on a PIC Micro, uh, a PIC 18F4620. Um, it has a large amount of uh, memory, so it is able to read SD cards or MMC cards. Here you see uh, a wave file uh, on the computer. This is the same wave file uh, on the SD card. Um, we copy that one there. Um, <clears throat> the audio format is um, 11 kilohertz, 16 bit or 8 bit audio. We close the SD card, remove it. It's uh, actually it's a micro SD because I didn't have any SD sockets, uh, but I did have a micro SD to SD converter, so I soldered all the wires on there. Um, that one goes in there. Okay, um, this is obviously the SD card. <coughs> this uh, display, this is for uh, adjusting a contrast. <coughs> this is the PIC 18F4620. Uh, uh, this is the digital to analog converter. It's uh, actually just a bunch of resistors uh, connected to the digital port uh, of the PIC, uh, which is port B. It goes to this wire here. The LED actually does nothing, it's just a support. Uh, this wire goes all the way this way, back there, to the amplifier here, which is in turn connected to the loudspeakers. Um, because the PIC Micro requires uh, 5 volts and the SD card requires 3.3 volts input, um, I actually had to use uh, this, which is actually uh, just an ATX power supply from a PC. It's uh, been modified, it's on right now. Um, this wire is the plus 3.3 volts, this is the uh, 0 volts. 0 volts is connected to the 0 volts uh, on the breadboard. The 3.3 volts goes to the power supply of the SD card. These are some resistors uh, used uh, for level converting uh, to make sure we don't blow up the SD card. Um, this is my little power supply and this is the programmer I use. It's the uh, WISP648. Okay. Now we turn on the power. It says init OK, FMT OK, data size OK file size and we play it. Currently it only plays the one file, uh, test8m16.wave. Um, the program is uh, written uh, using the Micro C compiler by Microelectronica. Um, it is version 8.1. Um, that's because the newer compiler, uh, Micro C Pro, 
which is this one, uh, somehow uh, doesn't work with SD library for me. Um, when I uh, use Micro C Pro, uh, it actually doesn't initialize the controller. It doesn't even uh, run the commands before initializing the SD card. So it must crash somewhere, but I don't know. So that's why I'm using this old version. Um, the program actually is not mine. I just uh, modified it a little to play my WAV files. Uh, the program uh, I found on this uh, uh, forum or uh, whatever it is, um, it's uh, it's made by someone who tried to convert the Swordfish uh, WAV player <coughs> to um, uh, Micro C uh, to use it with uh, with Micro C. Um, the info for uh, for the files I got from this website. You can find all these sites uh, in description. And uh, I used this little program called uh, XWISP2 for Windows uh, to send everything through the uh, programmer to the piece uh, to the Pic Micro. It also does <clears throat> does this uh, sometimes. It uh, it waits for a long time. It could be an hour. It could be twenty seconds. Uh, I don't know where th that problem lies, but I hope to fix it soon.